the hell? I have to do this every time? What the fuck? Why can't I just default to... Whatever. Okay. Hey there, guys. This is basically your 3 here with the uh, Let's Play of Undertale. They're supposed to... Hold on. Let me restart the... <laughs> Quitting. Let me restart the fucking game already so that we can pay attention to the story. It's really stupid how it doesn't default automatically to full screen. You had to press F4. Is there a way to permanently do that? Alright, whatever. Story of night time. Long ago, two races ruled over Earth. Humans and monsters. Oh, what happened to them? <laughs> One day, war broke out between the two races. Oh, let me just move the mouse away. After a long battle, the humans were victorious. They sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell. Seems like the story is going for, um... Simplicity Storm. Many years later, Mount Ebot, 2001X. Legends say that those who climb the mountain never return. Ooh. That's where our journey lies, I'm guessing. Oh no. Is that us, or is that just some dude, some dumbass kid that <laughs> fell into the abyss of the volcano, or whatever the hell this is? Yeah, I noticed, um, the- actually the TV is uh, actually a lot more brighter than my computer screen, but I kind of had to play on the computer screen so it, there's no delay. Oh, whatever. Okay, um... Alright, we get- so it sets you up immediately to the, uh, this thing it immediately. Alright, so let's- okay, so I have to remember. Z, confirm, X is cancel, and C is the menu, okay? So I just really need only these three buttons, and that's about it, and the arrow keys. Got it. Enter- name the fallen human. I guess, base? I mean, who else am I gonna name it? I don't even know the default name for this one, I'm just gonna name it my own character. Is this name correct? Yes. So, I've heard plenty of great things about this game, but I will be the judge of that, so I'm guessing this is me. It's kind of weird how it doesn't have control support. In the Steam page itself, it says it has control support, but I have no idea how to set it so that it does, but... Uh, I fell into a bed, kind of like when Cloud fell into a bed of, uh, flowers in that Eris. I can't believe I still remember that somehow. Uh, yeah, this is going to be weird because, like, the screen on the computer screen is going to be really dark, but... It doesn't have that bad of a delay. I think I can pay attention to the TV screen. Hopefully it doesn't have a... It's an RPG. I doubt that I really need a whole lot of input in order to really um do anything here. So whatever. Unless it's like one of those like action RPGs. I have no idea. I don't know how, how what um, Undertale is going to be all about. Howdy! I'm Flowery. Flowey the flower. Hmm. You're new to the underground. Aren't ya? Aren't ya? Aren't ya? Alright, I'm seeing a little bit of a grammar issue right there. Golly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how, to th how things work around here. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. Uh... See that heart? That is your soul. The very... The very culmination of your being. Alright. So I can move my heart thing? Is this how the ga gameplay um... Yeah? Your soul starts off weak, but it grows strong if you gain a lot of level to the point where it overrides the box? Or the box get bigger later on too. What's level stand for? Why, love of course. <laughs> you want some love, don't ya? Don't worry, I'll share some with ya. <laughs> okay. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can. Alright. Ow. You idiots! What? In this world, it's killed or be killed. Why would anyone pass up the any opportunity like this? Oh shit! Okay, so I'm guessing I had to- Oh fuck, okay. Well, you tricky little fuck. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! No! Oh- Okay, it just disappears over time, I'm guessing. Wow, that flower is one messed up dude. 
what a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Ah, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. So that's your uh, gameplay right there, avoid white shit. Like all my ex-girlfriends. Alright, this way! Uh, yeah, it's... Everything's just dark around here, I can't see shit. Thank god there's some sort of light source that I can remember to see through. Alright, uh... You better not be another one of those trap things. Okay. I don't think I... Should I touch the yellow thing? Oh, let me touch the yellow thing. The shadow of the, ruin lo uh, the shadow of the ruins looms above, filling you with determination. HP fully restored. Okay. Oh, and there's a safe one. Okay. Alright, got that. Alright. Dun, 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 dun. I don't know why, but the music can- Okay, never mind. <laughs> I was supposed to say it kind of reminded me of like those like conversation um, social links with Fire Emblem, but now um, the, f the music is uh, more... Uh, energetic, I'd say. Anyways, welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate and I am recording this, right? <laughs> Alright, I remember the last Fire Emblem- Sorry, not Fire Emblem. I remember the last Earthbound episode, and remember I don't- I didn't record my audio. Okay, good, I'm recording my audio song, that's good. <laughs> Shit, alright. Um, allow me to educate in the operations of the ruins. Okay. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve the. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. All right. So I'm guessing I move from this, this, this to this to open that door key or that door room. All right then. To make progress here, you'll need to trigger several switches. Do not worry. I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. I'm guessing these signs tell me. Press Z to reset. <laughs> I did that. Well, thanks for the tip, dude. Um, alright. <laughs> Splendid! I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. I don't trust you, goat lady. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to prepare for the situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Alright. You encountered the dummy. Alright, um, so... I have to fight. Uh... Oh, shit, so it's, oh, it's kind of like Carmel Squad, where I had to, like, go to the middle or something. And it looks like it's going to fall over. Oh, that's not in the middle. Oh, hey, I beat it still. I were <laughs> Nothing! Ah, the dummies are not for fighting. They are for talking. We do not want to hurt anybody, do we? Come now. Alright. There is another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Okay. There is a snaky thing there. Oh, wait, hold on. Wait a minute. Let me count the vines. There are two vines. I'm guessing... Each of them taking three squares of pixels. And there's a snake look looking thing. There's a sign here. What the fuck? Okay, random counters. Uh, frogs attack you. Alright, act. Uh, threat, check, or compliment. I'll check it. Life is difficult for this enemy. Alright. Uh. You won! You earned nothing. Okay. I checked it, but I didn't really compliment whatsoever. The western room in this eastern room's- The western room is the eastern room's blue, uh, blueprint. Alright. Oh, okay, I think I- Okay, I get it. Um, This is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. And then you're gonna eventually go up. Yeah, okay, so yeah, the snake thing is the- uh, I get it now, so... Yeah, the spikes go down from- Okay, yeah, I get it now. I could've easily solved that. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. You have done excellent thus far, my child. 
However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Okay. I'm gonna follow this white path. Maybe it'll help me. Oh, the, uh, the music kind of reminds me of those, like, bloopity bloops of Earthbound now. I can see that um, the music has some inspiration from that game, definitely. Um, is this gonna be, like, a never-ending pathway, like Super Mario 64? With the stair thing and the road to Bowser? Oh, there's a thing there, okay. Now what? Greetings, my child. Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind the pillar the whole time. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? But if I want to be truly independent, I could move there, right? Alright, so I have a cell phone now. Can I use it? Call her mom? Flirt? Uh... This is Toriel. Huh? Did you just call me mom? Well, I suppose. That... Would that make you happy? To call me mother? Well then, call me whatever you like. Alright. About yourself, say hello. This is Toriel. You only want to say hello? Well then, hello. I hope that suffices, hee <laughs> hee. I'm not gonna flirt with mom, what the fuck's wrong with you? This is Toriel. Want to know more about me? Well, I am afraid there is not much to say. I am just a silly little lady who worries too much. Alright, so... I think I had to progress. But what happens if I really do stay here for a while? Well, we'll be right back in the next episode to find out, so stay tuned for that!